of the beginner's makeup series. I'm so sad. If you didn't know, I'm doing a series about like beginner's makeup tips and things like that. So you guys can totally check out the other few episodes that I did before this. This is the fourth episode, which means the last. So I'm going to be answering the biggest question. How do you buy makeup without spending all of your money? Because makeup can be so, so expensive. Expensive. There's lots of things you can do. Saving, doing chores, asking for birthdays and Christmas. You could walk the dog around your neighborhood. Just do fun things that you could get money for. But the biggest thing is that you don't have to buy expensive brands. So I know that you're probably thinking me as a hypocrite because I do have some very good brands which I'm very grateful for because some brands reach out to me and they like to send makeup to YouTubers. Which is amazing and so nice, but if you're not a YouTuber, buy cheap brands. These are three of the best e.l.f. products that I've had. So it's a concealer, a blending brush, and a powder. So this is just an example. Here's my makeup stand. So of course I'm not saying that you shouldn't buy big brands like Urban Decay and Tarte and things like that. Like of course, if you have the money to spend, you can totally buy expensive products. I'm just saying that if you would rather save money, you can totally buy cheap products. Like this primer was like $10. I love makeup shopping. that you can use to try on the makeup before you buy it to make sure that it fits your skin color and it looks good on you. And don't be intimidated by the workers. They always just want to help and they're always so, so nice. Thank you doll. Have a good one. Good luck with everything. So now we're at Target. Target has very reasonable prices. Say you just got $25 for your birthday and you want to buy your first thing of makeup. This is what I would recommend for your starter kit. Target has lots of brands here and they're all super nice, but for starters, I recommend e.l.f. Concealer, beauty blender, bronzer, and highlight, mascara, and a liquid lipstick. And that is all $24 plus tax, so you've just spent your $25 gift card. And sometimes you can even go to your local grocery store and get any type of makeup there. Thank you guys so, so, so much for watching this video. I know that when you're shopping for makeup for the first time, it can be kind of stressful, but just remember that the people at makeup stores are always super, super nice, and makeup shopping overall is super duper fun. I can't believe this is the last episode. I've had so much fun with this series, and I hope you guys have learned something, and I'll see you guys next week.